course, believe it or not, those midterm elections now just eight days away, which means you're running out of time to research what's on the ballot. Beyond the candidates, there are several topics you may not know about. Matt McCutcheon is here with us this morning to break some of those down. Good morning, Matt. Good morning to you. Yeah, today actually kicks off the final week of early voting, if you can believe it, meaning there's maybe some surprises you could find on the ballot. We want to make sure you are informed. This election isn't just about the candidates. Everyone will have a yes or no question about passing the state budget, not exceeding estimated revenues. Now, some some voters will also have several questions to answer. For example, take this right here. If you live in these three counties, Johnson, Mary, and Hamilton, you'll be asked specific questions to vote on a school safety and improvement plan, which will in turn cost you more money on your taxes if approved. It's no surprise that includes Noblesville, where leaders are wanting to make improvements after this school shooting last May inside Noblesville West Middle School. Of course, the race everyone knows, however, pits Democrat incumbent Joe Donnelly against Republican Mike Braun. Their campaign commercials have been airing nonstop. Libertarian Lucy Brinton is also in this fight, but is lesser known. This race, of course, is getting national attention since it's a crucial Senate seat for national party power. Now, we've been asking, how do you feel about this election season on our WTHR Facebook page? You can see the results right there on your screen, mostly with some sad and angry feelings. Now, depending on where you live, you may also find yourself having to answer a lengthy question on your ballot. We're working to break that down for you a little later here on Sunrise to make sure you are an Indiana insider so you can be informed when you vote. Ben and Julia. All right. Thank you so much, Matt.